Welcome to Kyan's World Review. Hey guys, today I'm going to build a volcano with this build volcano kit. I just um I just want to mention some things I know of that a volcano or under, way underneath the surface of the earth. Um um all those rocks down there are actually no. And then when they rise up to the surface of the earth, that's called lava. But when they're still on the deep, that's called magma. And let's open this. Move that over there. Maybe move these over there. We're missing one. We're just stuck in the... Arrange that over there, put the rubber band over there, put this over there, then put these over there, put these over there, put these over there, put that over there, put that over there. Okay. Instructions for assembling your volcano. Warning, added supervision required. Science projects like this one can get messy. So prepare your work station by putting down some newspapers. I need your help, Daddy. I need, I need you to build the kit for me while I read the instructions. Okay. Number one, arrange the three volcano models in any order within the mold base. Number two, stretch the included rubber band around the mold and place within each notch. Yep, this is what should it look like beyond the first beyond the first step. Put a rubber band around it. Okay, what next? Number three, pour entire contents of volcano plaster bag into a large container. Set it aside, add one cup of water into another container. Number four, gradually add your plaster to the water while stirring. Let the mixture sit for one minute to allow the powder to absorb all the water. Number five, once the plaster is mixed and ready, pour it into the volcano. Let it sit for 30 to 45 minutes. Now we're gonna pour it. Pour it. Like, this is gonna take a while because we're gonna, because, because, because we had to wait until it dries. Yep, we're gonna come back until it dries. Two days later. Hey guys, back again on our exciting next steps after drying the plaster inside its volcano mold. I actually waited two days for the plaster to dry completely before we started to paint it. Come again and join me on painting the plaster volcano. I've got three colors of paint here, which are black, red, and yellow. These paints are actually included in this kit. And now I'm gonna show you how I'm going to paint the volcano mold. So let's get into, 
into it. But first, I need a help from my daddy to cut the tips of this paint for me. While I'm waiting for daddy to cut these painting tips, I'm gonna open this volcano bottle. Okay, I think I take it from the bottom. Take the rubber band off. Gonna show you where the Oh, only one bit fell out. So here's what the volcano looks like. From the inside, it's been raining for two days. And <laughs> this is a messy experiment to me. Scrape. This like scraper. I'm gonna scrape this off. <laughs> it's kind of funny that I don't have the scrapers on using this instead. Number six. Once the plaster has set, carefully remove the mold and use your stirring stick to scrape of any mold lines that are left behind. Number seven, the plaster must dry completely before you paint it. And then get brush ready. First, let's uncut the black. So, still in the black. Oh, that's actually really cool. Okay, time to brush it. Put more. Okay, I'll put some down here. So how do you like up the first side? Yeah, it's good. Looking good. This is what the brush looks like on the top. I think I need one of the to wash it. I'm not sure how it's gonna. My daddy told me to start at the top, so I'm doing some at the top. Oh, it's it, it, the red part is actually super quick. That I can actually finish this in um four on three minutes. It's so annoying how much time it takes for the paint to come out. Yeah, it is kind of annoying. So that's making me do it for three minutes and not just like one minute. That's enough of that side. You go on the other side. It's only highlight. Yep, it's only highlight. Some civilization we've done. Our volcano is ready to be born. All I need to do is fill these gaps over here. Okay, guys, our new volcano was born, and that looks like KFC ketchup. <laughs> That's a little bit funny. So this is eruption powder A and this is eruption powder B. You're gonna mix it in here. Now we can witness a volcano explosion. Okay, so that messed up everything. For all of the time we've been waiting for, we're going to witness a volcano eruption. Okay. Time to pour it in here. It 
it looks like a volcano. <coughs> and of course, volcanoes look messy. Keep slowing down. More. Uh oh. You didn't even some see some over here. We can go yeah. into the back. So hey guys, a new volcano eruption is born. This is our first volcano eruption. <laughs> Wait, if, what if it's actually hot? I wouldn't touch it. <laughs> what if it's like a real volcano and it's actually hot? <laughs> so that's everything we need to do from this build your volcano kit. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Also, don't forget... Um, don't forget to watch my next experiment. Bye!